it's Renee welcome to my channel so for today's video I'm just gonna go through and film a Target haul so this is kind of really like a mini Target haul in the try-ons you'll notice I look a little different I'm like wearing different stuff it's because I recorded this try-ons came out fine but I didn't really like how like the lighting looked and how like the positioning looked for like how I looked when I was filming like the showing you part so not the try on, so like me talking like this. I just feel like it came out really weird. It just like didn't look right. So I was like, you know what? The try ons are fine. I'll keep those. And then for the talk through part, I will just sit back down in another time and redo it. I think that's fine. During the try on, I realized that I was missing something. I was like, I can't figure out what it is I'm missing. And I was like looking in my closet and then I found it. And I was like, okay, I'll include the other thing. And then I'll include a try on of what I look like today in when I'm showing you all the things. Yeah, if you would like to see this Target haul and try on, stay tuned and we'll get into it. Yeah, if you haven't really checked in in a while or if you haven't really been keeping up because I haven't been um, posting in a while, I'm in a new space. I'm in my new dorm for grad school. And yeah, things are going good. This is kind of the setup for now until I figure out something different. Then I'm gonna buy some other prints from Amazon and put them on my wall. And then I'm gonna do a dorm tour just like in here because I think that'll be really fun and really cute. But um, yeah, let's uh, let's get into this. So for the first item, these are actually dirty because I've already worn them. So I took them out of my laundry basket just to show you. But these are just some cute red shorts. They're really soft and really comfortable. They're great for wearing under skirts or wearing to bed, which I think is really solid. These I believe I got for, I think these were $7.70, which is like such a good price. They look kind of like red. They're basically like red and black, really, really tiny, thin stripes. So they have kind of like that cool two-toned effect when you look at it from like the side. Kind of like how like a holographic Pokemon card used to look. Like I feel like it gives me that vibe. But yeah, I actually wore these underneath my skirt to a job interview. They don't really ride up. They're great for walking around in and they're really soft and breathable for sleeping, which I think is great. I'll try to list everything because a lot of this stuff, I think all of this stuff was clearance items. So I will do my best to try and find everything and hopefully I can. But if not, I'll try and find to see if I can find like some comparable stuff. It's always, I think, crucial to find really good shorts like these. The only other ones that I like the most are the ones I ordered from Amazon and those of the just my size black shorts and a 3x these are in a 4x and those ones are just like plain black whereas these are obviously red but yeah i think that they're just really cute really cool and really different i know that target kind of gets a lot of flack because like their stuff is their sizing is kind of weird and they do go up to a 4x and their wild fable stuff and then like their ava and viv stuff is like their women's brand and it's not like the most trendy i think that it could be but i will say something about target and that target in a lot of regards has um kind of made plus size clothing a lot more affordable and a lot more approachable for a lot of people i mean i do wish that they went higher than a 4x for those that need them i'm like a 3x 4x in a lot of their stuff and a 24 26 in a lot of their stuff so like it's approachable for me like i go to target and i buy plus clothes like a lot of my clothes are from target like the only like my outfit isn't but like whenever normally i'm wearing stuff for videos it's from target because They've taken a lot of like the cool trendy like trends that are in right now and they kind of made them in a very affordable, a very approachable way. I totally get that it is fast fashion and it is a big corporation, but at the same time, it's like plus size clothes are really expensive. And yes, they will last like a long time if you get them from like Lane Bryant or Torrid, but I have stuff from Target that has lasted me for years. So it's kind of like that give and take kind of thing. Like yeah, fast fashion isn't very good and you shouldn't really be supporting places, but like at the same time, for a lot of people, it's what they can afford and it's what they can use so I guess it's just kind of like your own best judgment but at the same time like I need clothes to wear like I need cute things and I want clothes to wear that's my choice and I don't know that's just a, it's a whole thing and I could go on about that for a while whatever other than that I really like those shorts they're really affordable and they're really cute and I just like them a lot so for another thing I've been really trying to come out of my comfort zone and wear a lot more like form-fitting dresses obviously you can see right now I'm wearing like tighter shorts like more um, belly showing shorts and like just a t-shirt and it says feeling fine I got it from Old Navy Old Navy makes the best t-shirts I'm gonna do an Old Navy haul too just all the shirts and sweaters that I bought because they're so good but yeah i've been trying to find like not skin type but just more body con more form fitting dresses because they don't really own a lot and i really like them so this is again from wild fable just like those shorts were this was nine dollars and 80 cents and it's just a more of a form fitting simple cotton black dress what's weird I, I got this color and i got this teal color my sister actually found a lot of these things and showed them to me i got this and i got the teal color and it's very strange because the teal color i think is a lot longer and i think is a lot cuter this one's 
really short and I feel like I constantly have to like pull it down they're the exact same piece of clothing but different colors and I feel like for some reason like the different colors like I don't know if they like changed it up I don't know if the fit was different I don't know if they were like done differently but I feel like just the uh, more tealy one fits better this one is still cute but it's definitely gonna have to be more of like a layering piece to go on top of something because if I take too many steps you can like see my butt cheeks and that's not really what I'm about like I mean maybe sometimes but not like at a normal day-to-day -day thing and this is more of just like a layering piece in general because it is so thin but I do like it it is comfortable I could even wear this to sleep if I wanted to which I have done from other skin tight things if I don't wear them all the time I will like just wear them to bed because they're really comfortable and if I end up not wearing this that's what I'll do a good price nine bucks or ten bucks for a really cute black dress and I just think it's just an easy something to have and you can easily find stuff in um, Target's clearance section which is a very like cool approachable thing to do and then this I actually so there's two things in this haul that I bought a while ago but they've kind of just been sitting in my closet and I haven't really worn them or really done too much with them but again this is just a really cool unusual piece it's more of like a skin tight romper and it has a like, kind of that scuba knit feel in another one of my videos I said I, I'm not a huge fan of scuba knit scuba knit I think kind of works here. Like I think it's like one of those things where I wear it every once in a while or like I wear it to like the beach or just like underneath something easy. But yeah, this is more of a bodycon romper rather than like the loose like floral, loose floral rompers that you typically see in the springtime. This I got on clearance and I think it's really, really cool. Like I said, it's very like very 90s, very cool. It kind of gives you like that track short and like two piece tracksuit kind of thing, but it's one piece, which is really easy. I got this is a 4X and I got it for $8. And yeah, I just think it's a really cool look. I like I said, I've had it for a while and this is one of the things you'll see where I look like this how I look currently trying this on but it has nice thick straps I think this would be really cute since it is so form-fitting to wear it underneath like a really like oversized like jean jacket just kind of give that cool look and like maybe like some all white vans or something but it's just really cool I feel like this is very much like kind of like urban or like city apparel and it kind of just has like that cool like streetwear vibe which is something that's really hard to find in plus size fashion unless you're shopping from like ASOS or something but yeah it's really nice because the shorts are long enough to not be like chafy or anything like that and it kind of gives me that appearance that I wanted with this black dress but instead it's more like shiny and it's just a little bit easier to wear and it is just less things to think about it does suck to have to wear stuff like this like when you have to pee but other than that I feel like it's fine and it's very adventurous and it's just a little different oh yeah so this is the basically the same thing as the black dress but this is the one that's in teal and I don't know why I think like I said I think it just fits a little bit better it's a little bit longer when I walk it doesn't really ride up but again it has really thick straps this is like the most like cheap thing that I bought and it is so it was so affordable it was only four dollars and 20 cents and I'm like eh, 420 blaze it bleh, but whatever but yeah I think it's really cute it has a kind of a cool almost square neckline which is a little different normally you just see like a nice like round or circle neckline but yeah like I said I think that this fits a little better again I think it would be really cute just with like a jean jacket like an oversized one and like some white bands or maybe some black bands so since it is getting a little bit cooler it's a good layering piece to just wear with like leggings or tights and like with a jacket and it's just like a little bit more form-fitting and if you're trying to like work and like are you trying to get out of your comfort zone of mostly wearing like fit and flares or like t-shirt style dresses or skater skirts this is like a good start because it's not too tight but it's like tight enough to still give you that bodycon effect and i just think it's really cute and really fun i love the color it was so affordable and so cheap and such a good just piece to have so for another thing i love smocked stuff i'm really really into smocked things right now smocked is like that stretchy part right here and this is just like a really little mini cropped smocked peplum shirt lots of words and it's slightly it kind of goes like this kind of like a half circle like that's like what the hemline is and then it has little tied straps which is nice because it makes it adjustable for you so if you want to make it a little tighter you want to make it a little looser it can basically fit like maybe like a 5x or like a 6x and this is in a 4x i got this for eight dollars which i think is really good but yeah like i said this is i bought um because it was i bought it when it was still a little bit warmer out and it was more the end of summer it's been a couple weeks since i've actually filmed the other thing or the other video just because like i've been so busy i haven't had the time to like sit down and like film another one and like edit them all like I just haven't had the time truthfully and yeah and so like I said I just really like this I think this will be really cute just like with some denim shorts like kind of honestly it would be like, cute probably with these ones or maybe just like some darker ones to go with like the uh dark stripes but I like all the stripes I love um the contrast of like dark blue light blue and yellow and white more like cool colors and like warm colors I love that contrast and I think this really fulfills a lot of that for me and again it's just like really cute and really flouncy and you can kind of like twist and twirl and it's just it's really cute I like it it's just super simple and really like I said smocked is nice because it can kind of fit almost anyone and it like you can wear a lot more stuff if you can buy it in like a smocked fashion because it is so stretchy and then it's just comfortable like I wore a smocked shirt 
similar to Pride this year and I really really liked it. But yeah, like I said, nice and flowy and loose and just like easy breezy. Now this is another thing that I have been wearing, oops this is sleeves inside out, that I have been wearing for kind of a while and I've had it for a while. When I bought this I think this was around $6.50. Again, another 4X, and this is a flannel, but it's a very light flannel, which I think is really nice because I like flannel a lot, but it can get really heavy, and I did buy it in March when it was still a little bit cold, and I've been wearing it a lot, but I thought it would just be cute to include because I bought something specifically to match with it a couple weeks ago, so that's why I'm including it even though it's been so long, but I really like the contrast. Again, I like that it has a little bit of yellow, some dark blue, some gray, some like light blue, you know, just lots of colors, like a nice cool, like, like not plaid, I don't think this is, maybe like a big plaid or like a square design. Again, it's really soft, it's really comfortable. I've been wearing the crap out of it, which is why it looks so like washed and like worn already. And yeah, like I said, I like a nice light flannel for California because it can get really, really hot. Maybe like in March or um, like springtime, this kind of works because it can get warm, but it can be really cold at night. Same thing with the winter, it can really kind of just depend on like what global warming is doing to us. So yeah. Having more like predictable or having unpredictable weather kind of goes for like random clothes like this where like you need something that's maybe more like light but still like enough to like keep you warm or to keep you cool. Then I think that's where this comes into play. And yeah, I just, I really like this. I wore this to my building meeting and this is what I wore in the original try on video. Like when I was telling you about all the clothes because I bought this to go with it. And it's just a really another smocked shirt, but it's more of a crop top and it's like the exact same lavender color that's in the shirt, which I really, really like. Again, I like smocked shirts. This one's a little bit shorter just cause it is like a true like crop, almost like tube top kind of look. This is in a 4X. I believe this was around maybe eight dollars maybe seven dollars it was very cheap everything in this basically was under ten dollars which is so so good because it's all clearance stuff and it's really like nice and really cute and I really like it but yeah very thin spaghetti straps which I will dock it for but it's not a huge deal I did just wear this over it because I wanted to still have a cropped look but I wanted to like be covered because it was cold but yeah really cute with like some light wash distressed jeans which is what I wore it with again very stretchy because it's smocked like look how much that bitch is stretchy. And I really like it. It also is nice too, because it has a nice little lettuce hem, which it's hard sometimes to get like smocked and something else. It's nice to have like little extra details like that. And again, I'm obsessed with smocked things. I would just own only smocked shirts because I think they're just such a cool look. And it's so different than wearing just like a plain shirt like this. I really like it. I think that these two paired really, really well together. Like they're almost exactly the same color. This one's just maybe a teensy bit darker. But yeah, I think they all just came out really cute and you will see them in the try-ons how they fit on me. Actually getting started on another haul and I completely forgot one of the other things that I did buy from Torrid, which I adore. Not Torrid, from Target, which I adore. Is this really just like beautiful, like slate blue romper. I love rompers and this is like a nice like flowy romper. I feel like this is a really good like date romper It's just like look how pretty it is. It's got like that nice really thin pleating and it's just beautiful and it fits me like perfectly Like I feel like this was built for my body This is one of the other things too that I think I forgot to include in the original video But I was going through my closet to find the clothes for my next haul and then I was like oh, I bought that and I completely forgot this I got this was the most expensive thing So not everything was under $10. This was $14 and it's just so cute I wish it came in black because I would literally wear both all all the time it's so beautiful and so cute it is spaghetti strap and it has adjustable straps so it's not like perfect again I feel like it's just so pretty and just so cute and it's really much more of a spring and summertime piece even though it is a fall color it's a little tricky but I'm sure I can like make it work I I don't mind I will like wear shorts in the winter like I'll freeze to death for fashion I don't care but yeah it's really beautiful really cute very stretchy look at that waistband nice and stretchy nice and comfortable but yeah this is the other last thing that I completely forgot about and I just wanted to include real quick before I moved on and completely forgot yeah that is everything I hope you enjoyed this video if you did leave a like down below comment and subscribe if you're great to have you here again my name's Renee thanks for watching